Well, here we are again in the fraudster's prison. Bunch of minsects just doing their thing. Roach over here. Roach, the evil prisoner who's getting seven years for fraud. Welcome back, guys. Prison Architect in preparation for Prison Architect 2, which I am looking forward to. And if you caught me on the first couple episodes, I do have my skepticisms of how it's going to play out. But I do enjoy this version. Um, the micromanaging is pretty wild. Pretty wild. Like, you can min-max it, whatever, but I like to kind of RP a little bit when I play this game. It kind of makes it a little more realistic instead of just trying to cram everybody into a shell. But, yeah. I'm glad you can all be here today. I hope you're having a good day. Um, I think the goals for today are, we talked last time a little about maybe adding a minimum security section down here. But the more I think about it, I'm... <sighs> I don't know. Let, let's just let's just jump right into it. Let's just plan. Let's just plan. See what we can do. What's going on here? We want planning. Planning. Walls. All right. Yeah, let's just take a look. So we're going to maintain this corridor here. Kick it out to there. Uh, I mean, I'm... I want it to work, but I'm, I'm, I don't know. Let's see. We're going to, we're going to make the men's security cells just a little bit bigger. We want those guys to be a little bit happier. So we've got one, two, three here. So we're going to go one, two, three, four. So we're going to give them a little bit extra space than what our minimum security guys. And we want to do this to make them happy and if we go that route we have this which you know what isn't the end of the world we can actually turn that into two solitary cells they're big solitary cells but let's use our space wisely so we're only going to be able to get looks like eight in this little section and you know what I'm okay with that <clears throat> I'm actually okay with that. I think eight's a good, a good number, because we can always now we know we can always extend this out more, and that works out. So we're just gonna go ahead and just knock it out. Just be done with it. Put it up there. It's cheap, under ten grand to get it laid out. And this actually serves two purposes too, because we can our guys are complaining they need some, you know, spiritual guidance in their lives. We can go ahead and make the church down here. Give them a little place to go. Go worship the holiest of the holies. I believe we also wanted to It won't be much. But it will serve its purpose. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, We're just a small prison right now. We don't we don't need anything big and fancy. And we're gonna keep it as we're just gonna use a general door for the infirmary. I don't I don't really care for this one. Two med beds. Could do four, but I don't see a need to at this time. How's everybody doing up here? Everybody looks okay. I mean, they want clothing, so that's another... Another little thing we can actually build that into is our laundry. Now the question is going to be is where do we want to put it? Million dollar question, right? Oh, you 
You got searched. Naughty, naughty. Did I not add foundations? I did not. Okay. So, fun thing. When you restart the game and you do walls, you have to auto foundation. We did not do that. Then <laughs> we'll go ahead and hopefully this fixes that problem. We are going to have to add some doors. We'll add that'll be a staff door there. We'll add a jail door there. Our general door here. We might maybe. What's our size requirements for the chapel? Okay, we need six by six. Which actually is gonna be a problem because this does not meet that requirements however however we go back into our planning we'll give them a seven by seven just to appease them this door we can keep it open and we want to go ahead we'll put in two because we're gonna need two for one of our grants I believe it was yeah inmate health and well-being so we also need a psychologist but we just haven't got one. We have the office. Go ahead and knock that out. All right? Did we meet it? We did meet it. We did get paid. Okay, good. Whew! I was confused there for a second. I think we can also. Our MinSec guys are doing pretty good. We'll go ahead and take care of their needs a little more up here. Some more showers. Some turlets. Jail doors. Oh. Oh, some shower heads. Nobody wanted to tell me about the shower heads? Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Well, he guess he showers in front of his door. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, Alright, so... Let's just think of how we want to do our... Our medium cells. So what we're also going to do, there's a deployment portion, right? So if we go up here, this is minimum security only. Only minimum security guys should be placed up here. And then once this is done, we'll designate this for medium security only. <clears throat> we should also do, though, so there's a mechanic, apparently, where if we look at grading, where's the cell grading option? Uh, prison grading, there we go. Nope, nope, that's not it. Well, the easiest way for me to explain it is, so let's just pretend like the cells have qualities, right? <clears throat> so if we look at this here, he says, cell quality one, very low. If you look <clears throat> just below his four days without incident there, there is a theory, whereas if we make another minimum security branch, where if we don't intake any additional prisoners, we make another minimum security, and say we make cells of this size, he gets two. The reason he's getting two is because he has more space. So 
if these guys behave, technically there's a chance that it could get upgraded into a better quality cell. So if we go ahead and we make a secondary minimum security cell block that has upgraded cells, they will actually shuffle prisoners around, I believe. I'll have to look at that mechanic a little more. Um, but I did see something on it a while back where they will shuffle prisoners. So if, if these guys act bad, you know, they'll get bumped down to this cell where this guy, if he's good, <clears throat> he'll get moved to a newer, better quality cell. But that's a mechanic we'll have to look at. I'm not 100% sure on that one. It is what it is. What's going on here? Why are we struggling with water? Guys are killing me, Smalls. We'll put some more in there. Do 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 do. And we also should send some electricity down here. Hmm. Probably be a good idea. There's a lot of activity going on down in this area of the prison that I feel like we should probably implement another form of metal detector. Probably in this general area, honestly. That guy got caught with a knife. That's not good for him. Alright, we do need to finish this one. already in the works. Already in the works. The construction boys need to finish their activities here. doing on staff. Yeah, I'm a little short on work, man. That's probably why it's taking a minute. But I would rather have another guard or two. Because we're going to get additional prisoners, so we want to make sure they're good. So these guys out here, unfortunately, we didn't give them any objects yet. At least they get outside and they go for a walk. Right. Oh, well, that's going to be a problem. Why? <sighs> Can we go ahead and put the walls up? Please and thank you. Oh, and it knocked all of our stuff over. All right, well, <clears throat> build mechanics are hard. Easy fix. Prison full of ragamuffins. We're working on it. We are working on it. Have some faith. Have some faith. We will go ahead and give them a laundry room, okay? Will that make you happy? If 
that makes you happy, it makes me happy. Laundry machine, maybe? We do four, three, Okay, is that better? Is that better for you guys? <laughs> oh boy. We do need some water pipes though. Save that just in case we need a additional. Hmm. So we can actually open that now that the wall is in place. And we did want to build a church for these guys. I'm curious about this. Maybe we'll do a a shop. Yeah. Let's do a shop. I've never done the shop before, so curious to see how it goes. Shop front. Place the shop front on a wall that stands between the shop and the area accessible. Oh, okay. So do we have to expand the shop? Is that how that works? I think we need them to build the wall first and then we can plop this in. We'll cross that bridge when we get to it. We will cross that bridge when we get to it. But first, we need to make sure our Larger machines get hooked up. <clears throat> Alright, so the medium cell block is done. But before we bring those guys in, let's go ahead and make sure we get this section of the prison squared away. Looks like at least everybody's happy. You know, they're getting uh, some visitation. And we can go ahead... Check our bureaucracy. We have psychology. Do Intel. Intel's a good start. So we have psychology. Where's our psychiatrist? Psychiatrist, he's there, right? Does he need a special office? I think he does. He needs a special office, I believe. Yep. <clears throat> there it is. Have at it. And we'll put a wide sofa in here. And a leather chair. Do you want to talk about your problems? Yes? Yes. I'll be slacking. What's going on here? Where's our walls? Guess I gotta do it myself. <clears throat> Janitors are doing the laundry. That's what's up. There we go. See, they got clean clothes now. Clean clothes. That should make them somewhat happy, right? Walls are being put in. Alright, let's take a look at the shop real quick. Shop front. Okay, there we go. And then I think for door. Well, we'll get to that. Alright, needs a table.
table, table, table. Alright. Table, table, smaller table, oak. Um, I think the oak table is the smallest one. I don't see the oak table on here. Oh, we'll just do table small. And then doors. I think that would be a staff door. Maybe. I don't know. We're going to find out. We are going to find out. And I think one of the other things I'd like to do is let's pop a light in these rooms because I don't see them on there. And then the other room we wanted to take care of was the chapel. Z Chapel. That pretty much extends the use of this area. So if we wanted to create an additional one, we're probably going to have to make a secondary corridor down to here and move it into something else. I don't know. I don't know yet. I don't know yet, but I do know we are low on money. Altar. Place for these guys to sit. And some Muslim prayer mats. That should suffice for them. For now. For now. There's always more. There's always more. Uh, what's going on with... Prison labor's looking good. Couple guys can do that. Couple guys can do that. Make sure that the schedule allows for work slash free time. No, uh, this is for everybody. You could sleep in a little longer. Nine hours of work and free time to be productive. Okay, let's go ahead and work on our medium security cells. So if we go along the wall, like so, so we don't flood the prison. Toilets on that side. Shower heads over here. And to give these guys a little bit extra, I think we'll go ahead Interesting. Let's go ahead so we can see what we want to put in there. Alright, bookshelves. We can do bookshelves. We can give them a chair or a wooden stool. Guys fighting. Sounds like somebody's fighting, but I don't see any fighting. Ah, the laundry. The good old laundry.
We should put somebody in the laundry, honestly. Anyway, before we were so rudely interrupted. Um, Want escape. Yep. That's how it be. Okay. So that's not terrible. I think that'll be a decent enough start for a medium security cell. And we have room for one more object in there, which will be good. But we also do want to make sure that we meet our... Security needs. This is our medium security section. Which once that's up and running that'll be great because we can acquire a few more. Visitors. Slack and get that stuff in there. Let's go. All right, so the prisoners are bored. We should probably go back. It gives them a little bit extra yard time. We have prisoners up for parole. Six to ten. Ten to two. Two to six. Always something. So, now that we have that section, we've got one medium security. Escapes. Escapes. Where are we getting out? Are they, like, literally sneaking through this area here? Is it because I don't have anybody stationed there? <laughs> All right. Well... Let's have some more. Anyway, as we try to go back here, let's go ahead and pull in Well, it's not going to matter. We're going to pull in whatever cuz we're we're going to Fill or to capacity, right? Yeah, we're going to fill capacity. 
Yeah, it don't matter. I really want to know where these guys are escaping. Am I missing this? Anywho. Sir, oh, you were a good little doobie, so they gave you a better cell. That's cool. But this is supposed to be for medium security. You guys got to go. Got to go. All right. Well, we got our medium security cells up. Not a whole bunch of them. We've got some of our basic needs taken care of, so that's good. Give him a chapel. Give him some laundry, a shop, infirmary. So we're meeting all of their basic needs, so they should be suppressed. So we do need to do a little more with the family stuff. I'm not sure what's going on there. <clears throat> We have five visitor booths. What are we? What are we lacking? Do we need to maybe uh, put another wall and have like a, a freaking conjugal visit room down here? I don't. I don't know. I don't know. A million dollar questions. But anyway. Oh, you got found with a spoon. All right. So this is our medium security guys. What did he do? Manslaughter, okay. DUI. Possession and possession with intent to supply. Found a shiv on him. Not a spoon. All right, so we do need to really consider another cook for sure. We're going to put two. Yeah, once you get about 30 prisoners, I think each one of those cookers is usually kind of maxed out at 30. But we need more cooks to do the cleaning and everything else on the back end. I mean, the nice thing is we should be having... Yeah, so we should have prisoners in here helping, which we could... Yeah, okay, so we do have it. Large procession, whatever. And we'll do one spiritual guidance session. So we got to remember that when we do these programs, they also chew through our money. So, got to stay on top of that. But everything's looking good. Everything is looking good, guys. That's looking great. If you guys are enjoying it, let me know. Leave a comment. Let me know how you're enjoying the game. How you're uh, 
feel about Prison Architect 2. Um, you know, we've we've all had the conversation about how we really feel about it potentially. But uh, if you're looking forward to it, let me know. Uh, if you like the videos, if you like what we're doing, hit that like button. And please, please, please hit that subscribe button. It helps. It's free. And it doesn't overload you with a bunch of BS. I don't I don't overload videos or do a lot of dumb updates. This, that, and the other. If I'm doing something, it's a gameplay footage. It's playthrough. Maybe the occasional special thing. So with that, I appreciate you stopping by. Thank you. And until next time, we'll see you.